Welcome back, everyone. This is the eighth streamcast. I'm Dicko Stonewall, uh, and tonight we have a lot of news. And um, before we get into the actual news that we have, uh, I want to address that um, we're going to have some wonderful ads tonight. Uh, we've been lucky to be sponsored by some ads, and uh, also we have some new commands in the chat. Uh, if you use exclamation mark merch, you can see the merch. And uh, if you use exclamation mark CSP, you'll get a link to the Cinema Scrutiny Podcast, another sponsor of the Streamcast. Do you like movies? Of course you do. Do you like being big brain about upcoming entertainment news to your friends? Hell yeah! Go watch the Cinema Scrutiny Podcast. They got two hosts. They got timestamp. They got Spooderman and another one and another one. They have three Spider-Man. They just hit episode 14. Can you name any other podcast out here with 14 episodes? I fucking dare you. Go watch it right now. Now, um, moving on. Sorry. Uh, recently, there's been a lot of additional uh, question voting ads for when you vote an additional, like, vote no on question one, as we see here. So they've been pretty rampant recently, but um, there's nothing more on that story, but we'll follow it, and if there's anything that changes, we'll make sure we tell you that. Are you tired of waiting 25 days till Christmas once November starts? Are you tired of all the other holidays that you have to do stuff that isn't as exciting as Christmas? Well, I want you to vote yes on question one to make Christmas a year-long holiday. How great could that be? Remember, vote yes. Pay for and funded by Christmas Game. Now moving on, we have um, Google Stadia is a little bit in the news, where one of their top employees came out and was kind of bashing uh, streamers, which is, you know, a weird target. But uh, recently on Twitch, a lot of people have been DMCA striked, and Twitch took down a bunch of people's VODs without telling them. Uh, to avoid, you know, lawsuits imagine, really. And, uh, dude comes out and says, uh, basically is, you, you should be paying for your music, which, you know, people can argue that, sure. And then he also goes on to say, and you should pay for your games. You know, streamers gotta buy licenses for games. What the fuck is that? A symbiotic relationship. It's like symbiotic titan. Everybody benefits. And this guy was like, nope. Game, game developers should benefit more. And then all the people who want to play indie games, they'd have to get a license and pay them, and they probably just wouldn't do that, so they probably wouldn't play indie games. So this guy is really stupid, and uh, if you're ever wondering why Stadia isn't doing well, probably because people like him are working on the team. Hey, I know that, you know, Thanksgiving isn't the biggest holiday, but it keeps small businesses like me uh, allowing to keep our doors open in these difficult times. So when it comes time to vote, I really hope that you'll vote uh, no on question one to keep Christmas a year-round holiday. Please think of think of the smaller guys out there. Paid for by literally every other holiday in the world. Moving forward, we have a Harvard study out uh, recently done that says uh, the most popular time uh, for streamers to be streaming is night, and uh, the second most popular time they found was day. So you know that's a pretty interesting study. <laughs> Did you know that Thanksgiving was a holiday made on enslaving people and stealing their land? Also, the food sucks. Christmas is about the actual birth of Jesus Christ and good family values. Vote oh, yes, so question one. Still made for and paid by Christmas game. And uh, I kind of want to take this time to really thank you guys. Um, you know, Big Christmas says a year on holiday is what you want, but is it really what you want? If Christmas was every day, then, um, you know, it, uh, it wouldn't be so special. And do you really want to support, like, a, a religion? You know, who can fact check the Bible? Who says Jesus wasn't black? Was he even born on Christmas? Can anyone prove that? Let me see the birth certificate. Oh, wait, you didn't have those back then. Big Christmas is trying to get you to get them into your wallet year-round, and I won't stand for it. Vote no on question one. 
Christmas does not need to be a year-round holiday. Keep the holidays as they are. This is paid for by Thanksgiving and the, uh, actually Halloween is my favorite holiday gang. Okay. Really enjoy. It means a lot every time you guys are here or you're talking in chat. And I just wanted to say thank you so much. Um, you know, hey, I'm just a guy like you. My name's Rich. Now, uh, you know, I, I eat, I breathe air, I watch television. But what I don't like on television is all these vote question, blah, blah, blah ads. We need to get rid of them. So vote uh, yes on question two to get rid of vote question ads. Paid for by Fisherman Rich. When I was just a little dicko being raised on the, uh, the cold, cold, unforgiving streets of <sighs> Bel Air. Um, yeah, it, it was tough. It was tough to get by. So see where I am. Rich says he doesn't like voting. What I don't like is- Oh, that's un-American. Rich also has a cat. Rich has no dogs. Why do you have no dogs, Rich? Are you a dog-hating racist communist? You never said you aren't. Vote no on question 24 on keeping Rich alive. This ad is paid for by people that really fucking hate Rich. It, it means a lot. So uh, from the bottom of our heart to the bottom of your heart, you know, thank you so much for, for watching and continuing to support the cast. Yep, um, now we're gonna move on to uh, weather, I think. So let's go to weather. Hello everyone, we're gonna get into the streamcast for tonight's evening. So um, as you can see, we got Among Us. We got a lot of people. Um, you can expect some sus, some 75 chance of self-recording kills. That's pretty sick. Um, you know, I didn't think anyone updated what the bottom part stands here. So that's a big oversight, and uh, we're just going to kind of roll with it. So, uh, yeah, we're going to be playing <laughs> Fall Guys, and um, it's a new game demo. Definitely, I don't know if you've heard of Fall Guys. It should be great. And, uh, you know, 6 your chance of liking it. That's actually probably still accurate. Uh, Fall Guys makes me very angry. Um, but later in the night, we're moving on to Rocket League. And, uh, sickly, this one's still right. Only gold games, high rank plays, and players, because I'm amazing at Rocket League. And by me, I clearly mean Nico. Not me, Dicko. I'm the, the newscaster. D Dicko's the other guy who people sometimes watch, but everyone's really here for me. Uh, moving on into our five-day... Our five-day forecast, we have a little bit of a mix-up. So, you know, I just told you what's happening on, on Friday, so do you really need me to tell you again? I don't think so. But moving on to Saturday, it's a ranking stream. We're going to be ranking all the games I've played and kind of keep up, like, a continuous list of games I've... Not me, but Nico. When I say I, I mean Nico. Has played, and uh, we're going to keep watching the games he's played and keep a list of how much he likes them. So, like, an overall rank for uh, Nico's whole streaming career. And then after, if we have some time, we might uh, fuck around with some AI dungeon. I heard Nico's a really big fan of that one. And then on Sunday, it's going to be 53 degrees and sunny. So uh, get out your surfboards and put them back because 53 degrees is pretty cold. Uh, then on Monday, we're going to be playing some Hades once again, which is long overdue. Hopefully we'll be beating it. And, but, you know, that really depends on Nico. That guy's not that good at that game. I could beat Hades, but Nico, I don't know. Um, and then some Minecraft later that night. Um, should be really fun. Kind of, you kind of doing some quest lines. I heard Nico's doing some quests on a server. I don't, I don't really know what all that means. But moving on to Tuesday, it's supposed to be 52 and rainy. So grab your umbrellas and don't put these ones back. Don't put them back like your surfboards. Keep them out because it'll rain. So if you're trying to go somewhere, you'll open the umbrella and then you'll be dry. Uh, yeah, that, that's how I'm told that works. Anyways, uh, thank you so much for tuning in and just stand with us and we'll be back very shortly. I've been Dicko Stonewall, and thank you. Have a good night.